Whale shark. The whale shark is the largest fish in the world. Whale sharks are blue, gray, or brown on top, with pale yellow spots and stripes. Whale sharks swim very slowly and are usually alone, but sometimes they can come together in schools of up to 100. They're usually found in the deep sea, but sometimes they swim closer to the coast. Hermit crab. Hermit crabs have a curled tail with a hook that enables their bodies to fit inside their borrowed shells. Sometimes when a new shell turns up, hermit crabs will form a line biggest to small to see which animal fits the new shell. Pufferfish. Pufferfish are fish that can inflate themselves with water or air. When inflated, some are nearly as round as a ball. The pufferfish is a family of fish with about 100 species. Sharks are the only animals immune to pufferfish toxins. Octopus. Octopuses are invertebrate, so they don't have a skeleton or backbone. Their soft bodies make it easy for them to squeeze into tight places. They're very intelligent. Crab. Crabs and other crustaceans have hard covering known as the exoskeleton. Like its relative to the lobster, a crab has five pairs of legs. There are over 6,700 species of crabs and they can breathe underwater. Starfish. Starfish come in all sorts of different colors like red, blue, purple, green, orange, pink, black, and white. The most common color is orange or orangish brown. Starfish, also known as sea stars, are related to sea urchins and sea cucumbers. Orca. Orcas are dolphins. They're the large marine mammals within the whale family. True to their name, orcas are effective hunters. They prey on seals, sea lions, fish, seabirds, turtles, octopuses, and squid. Orcas do not chew their food. They can swallow small seals and sea lions as a whole. Stingray. Stingrays with their wide flat bodies may not look like a fish, but they are. They're related to sharks, and like their shark cousins, they do not have bones. Stingrays live in salt water and fresh water and are carnivores, which means they only eat meat. Nautilus. Nautiluses are predators and feed mainly on shrimp, small fish, and crustaceans, which are captured by the tentacles. The nautilus has many tentacles. There's one in front and behind each eye with the outer circle of 19 pairs. Leafy sea dragon. Leafy sea dragons are actually fish. They have small transparent fins and dorsal fin on the back and pectoral fins on the neck. They are very poor swimmers and rely on their camouflage to avoid predation. Sea dragons are not dangerous. They're shy creatures and cannot move fast. Coral reef. A coral reef has a structure in shallow ocean areas that is formed mainly by stone-like coral skeletons. 
Corals are small marine animals that live in all oceans. The Great Barrier Reef is the most famous coral reef in the world, and thousands of animals call the reef their home. Monkfish. Monkfish, also known as sea devil, is a type of anglerfish that belongs to the goosefish family. It is also a bottom dweller and spends most of its life on the ocean floor. Monkfish is an ambush predator, which silently sits and waits for the prey to appear. Manta ray. The manta ray is the largest species of the rays. They have flattened bodies with flapping triangular fins, also called wings. They are usually black, gray, and white. Seal. Seals are marine mammals that spend most of their time in the ocean and can grow to be between 3.5 and 16 feet long. Seals sleep on the land and in the water. They can survive both in polar and in tropical waters. However, seals prefer cold sea waters. Giant river prawn. In total, there are 200 subspecies of prawns. One of the first subspecies of this crustacean discovered by scientists was the giant river prawn. It is a type of freshwater shrimp. Yes, yes, yes,